again, I think, cut the ass out. That shouldn't be there. Long video. Okay. Hello ladies and welcome back to my channel. I'm here again yet with another video and today I want to talk about why it is so important for all women, whether they're single or not, whether they're older or younger, to actually be on top of your A game. So let's talk about that. This is going to be really spicy and interesting. And before I get into the video, please make sure you do subscribe to my channel. Uh, give this video a thumbs up because obviously that helps with the algorithm. Duh. And now let's get into the video. And oh, don't forget to follow me on Instagram. Me, Lady Isha, I'm actually quite active on Instagram, promise. Now, why do I really say that it is really important for ladies to always be on top of the game? Well, A, because if you're dressed up well, you feel more confident. If you are well-educated, you feel kind of self-sufficient. If you're more creative, you feel really good about yourself. If you, well, all of these combined, gives you something which is very interesting and very important and actually that is a really good high self-esteem and when you have high self-esteem we all know what happens life becomes almost really magical okay when you have high self-esteem you're basically a woman of quality and that is really important now it's 2020 it's the 21st century and i feel like this is something we really lack i mean i hardly see people with quality does that make sense? And I'm not here to offend anyone. I'm sorry if I'm doing that, but you get the point. We see everybody following the same trends, all coming from the hip hop culture. And nothing against that, well, it is what it is, but in a way, it kind of sets you apart from the best, if that makes sense. And you don't want that. The best is not into pop culture, is not really into the hip-hop trends that is not following those icons that are worshipped but in reality if you break them down they don't even deserve that position so you instead of being a follower just just can you just come back in your own skin in your own league and just be what you really really are and, and be the best version of yourself instead of following into trends and following other people just because it's a trend you need to stop that right here it's just there's nothing cool about that there is honestly nothing classy about that it's just you're just wasting yourself away you're wasting your life and you're wasting your time and your money let's not forget about that money is a very important factor in your life if you're a woman of quality you'll be very very smart with money and i think we've all been in that position where we have all been kind of stupid with money some people learn the hard way and then some people are actually really trained very well to you know be a little more manageable with their money sometimes you have smarter parents so you're kind of lucky sometimes you don't have them and sometimes they spoil you rotten so you won't really learn these skills but these skills even if you don't have them no problem you can always learn these skills and i think skills is something you can learn at any time of your life there is really no timings for learning new skills okay and money managing time managing and all of these things these are skills that you can really definitely learn no big deal well, these were just some of the basic things. Now also let's come back towards dating and relationships. What happens when you're a woman of quality with high self-esteem and then you get into the dating pool or even marriage, let's say? You make the best choices. You come across better people because somebody who is below that level kind of is intimidated by you anyway. So they don't even reach out to you because you seem so much out of their league. And maybe it's good because you filter out the ones that are not even in your league. You filter out the ones, maybe league is not even such a nice kind word, but you kind of filter out everybody who is not on that level where they should be when it comes to you. Does that make sense? So a lot of times, you know, I get questions on Instagram asked from even married ladies. How should I keep up with myself? I have let myself go and I'm obviously now being punished for that. And yeah, that's true. When you let yourself go, it almost feels like as if life has started to punish you which is sad but that's the reality so you don't want to be punished by mother nature because mother nature really wants you to take care of yourself and if you don't <laughs> you're gonna reap the rewards in a really bad way so make sure you're always on your a game and by a game honestly i don't just mean your dressing and your makeup that's just a part of you but there is many other parts of you there is many other parts to take care of the spiritual the emotional, the mental, the physical, the health, the wealth. It's a lot of things. If we start talking about every single aspect, 
I'm gonna be here for days and days and days and I can speak a lot about that so let's not get into too many details here but you get my point what I'm trying to say so always be on top of your game okay if there is something you think is lacking in your personality is lacking in your physical appearance lacking in your diet maybe lacking in your health or wealth maybe then please try to take baby steps towards achieving and improving and improving everything about yourself however keeping in mind that you will never be able to reach a level of perfection and that is not what we're talking about here anyway we're not talking about some unrealistic unreal expectations of being a person no, no that's not what we're talking about we're talking about just being the best version of yourself just sit down with yourself for a while just think about what does your best version of you look like and once you know how she looks like he or she it goes the same for the men as well once you know what she looks like just work on everything that has to improve about yourself right now compare that version with your current state and you will see such a difference and if you have some sense you probably already know you could do so much better and you have so much potential of achieving a lot more of doing a lot more in life of living the best life you have so much potential and if you definitely know that you have the potential then it will be easy for you to kind of identify the differences between that version of you and then now this current version of you and then that will make it really easy for you to take the steps that are needed in order to improve and in order to get to that version of you i hope that makes sense these are the simplest words that i could use to put into my statements because sometimes I can really not be very good at explaining what I want to say I'm human okay and while we are talking about improving yourself let's not forget improving yourself actually really starts with self grooming reading a lot more praying a lot more there are so many steps that you can actually start taking right now in order to really start going towards the improvement and towards your potential best version of yourself that you have just written down on a piece of paper okay it's not really that unachievable it's actually really easy you just have to kind of break it down into a few statements into a few steps and there you go not complicated right anyhow by the way i also have a few level up videos on my channel so i will link them in the description for you guys if you're interested i definitely recommend watching them i also have done a video about level up mindset because you guys know when you start to improve yourself develop yourself mindset is the first thing you have to really take care of okay you need to shift your mindset that's that's the first step let's not even go into that because again as i said it's going to be a very long video which i really don't want anyhow i hope this video helped i know it's a very short little quick video but i really wanted to give you guys a little reminder of how important it is to take care of yourself and also if you guys are interested in really effective organic skincare body care, hair care products, definitely go and check out ishacosmetics.com. We have formulated some amazing, amazing products that work wonders for your hair, that work wonders for your body, for exfoliation. We have face masks, we have lip scrubs. We have a solution to most of your physical problems. Definitely check out ishacosmetics.com. And guys, on that note, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. And until then, see you guys next time. Bye.